Well, welcome back to another episode of uh, Harris Brothers Fishing. Uh, we're here down at Skinning Grove, uh, digging some worm. We're going to do a bit of fishing tomorrow, a little bit of sea running. Uh, we'll uh, bring you back when we start digging some worms. Well, we're here down at Skinning Grove digging some worms. Uh, let, let Carl show you how it's done. This is all we're looking for these here. Little worm cast in sand. Worm, they're not bad worms at all to be fair. Here we go, we've got the young lad down here today as well. Stand this side, try and get a bit of wind deflection off. Why is it gone off? There it is. Nice worms. Not, not bad at all. They're alright for what we need them for. Go get some more. Sorry about the wind if you can hear the wind. Horrible down here. Ah? Yeah. Sand that way, look first. There we go. It's only a baby one, that one, but yeah. it's still done for a tip off, won't it? <laughs> They're not very deep at all. Yeah. Not deep at all. As you can see, this is, this is all we're looking for, these. Just looking for worm past here, look. The thicker they are, the bigger they are, the better. This is, this is what we call blow lug. We've got a blow off, just behind, just in front of the cast. So, uh, no, uh, so really, the burrow like that, come round. So, cast will be there, blow will be there. And they live in a burrow underneath like that. And that's why we dig to the side of them and then trench it out. Everyone has different ways of doing it, right? Yeah, everyone has different ways of doing it. You can go straight down for him, but it gives them more chance to escape, doesn't it? There he is, look. As you can see, you just crouch the side, look, and you have the worms there, straight there. There he is, there. Uh... And again, they're not bad worms at all. Let's get your lid. Good lad. <laughs> He's loving it, aren't you, mate? Get them into it, young. And this is what we call a black lug. It's not. Nice, nice black, black cast there, look. It's not black lug, It's just because they're in coal there, look, in, in the sand. It's a big worm, isn't it? It's just a teacup. There he is, there, look. There 
is. There you go, look. There you go. <laughs> Come on in. As you can see, look, they're just all over the place, literally coming a foot away from each other. Nice, nice little bit of sea making. Plenty of dog walkers. Yes, Matt. Yeah. This one. Worms are moving. Look. Yeah. <laughs> Come on then. We'll get back to digging. We missed him. It's just a tail. Yeah. So don't kick them ones, dude. Let them ones go. He's got a little tiny white rag in his hand. <laughs> the easy part of the job to uh, cameraman. <laughs> that wind's brutal. There he is straight away look. It's only a small one in it that one. But it'll do. Oh we've got this. Yes, the tide, tide's coming in really fast look. You've got to be careful when you're down here doing this and the... Push that box, box. Yeah. You know, because then it surges straight back out, look. So you've always got to watch it. Yeah, there's, there's, there's the white bag, look. Yeah, I can see him. There he is, look. It's not a bad worm at all. Beautiful. Should have brought a bigger tub. <laughs> yeah, it's filled up pretty quick that one, didn't it? That one got away. You do get that sometimes where you're digging next to a, a little bit of a pond and it just fills in straight away so you get no chance of getting them. Terrible. Nah, it's good wind. I like wind. It's coming straight off the sea, so it's just going to make it, it's going to build. Looking for. 
There's the claw wall, there's the worm cast. Look, right next door. There's the wall. There's another the wall. There's the worms next to the other. There's millions of them. Absolutely millions of them. Little lad loves it. One book, the tip off, yeah. That's beautiful, beautiful, aren't they? Beautiful look, worms, blow look, whatever people like to call them, got different names. People call them yellow tails, blow look. shelter from that wind. So, no, I can always voice over, can I? There he is. Yeah, we missed that one. Chopped him up. So, look at this surgeon in here, look. Gotta be very careful when you're out digging in the tides turn. Especially on the big tides as well. Look at it coming in, coming in. The last thing you want to be doing is getting cut off and getting caught out by the tide. Somebody up there fishing already. A little bit keen. That's what we like to see, keen anglers. There he is.
this on. Well, is it? They're, they're quite milky, aren't they? Yeah. Really yellow. Look at that. Look at that. His hands look. <laughs> Same thing about worm. <laughs> Turn your hands yellow. It dies when you can't get it off for ages. It's like iodine. It's like iodine. Iodine, yeah, whatever you call it. No, put him on fork there, look. So don't forget the lid. So I say I thought you'd just come behind it, didn't you? Oh he's there. There he is. See look at the tide look. Look at it rushing. And then it just drains straight back out to there, look it's crazy. You've got to be very careful. We've chosen a really good day to, to do it, right? <laughs> it's raining, it's really windy. There he is, look. Lovely worms. Got Can you put me all up his head? My god, that wind. Just stay on top shot. Yeah. Nice work, that. Here you go. Probably won't get too many more because we don't need a lot, do we? We're only going to do a light fishing session tomorrow. Get the big rods out ready for the winter. Just go rock hard, nice and like leather, like licorice. Yeah, that's what it's like. Just eat it. <laughs> oh, that far, like. Safety is always number one priority when you come doing stuff like this. All the time. Safety on the way, son. Good oh boy. Let it come this side and have a look. Come this side and see. There you go. And you can see the worm down there, look. Just 
seen him shoot off like that. the sequel there, look, there he is straight now. Oh, you've just missed him, he's just dropped offside. Seen him going back. There he is. There he is there, look. Yes, Absolutely hammering it down, it is. Look at that. Not even one fourth deep, look, getting him. Class. As you can see now, look, we start to see more and more appearing. There's loads of them all over the place. Yeah, I don't think we're going to need too much, too many more, I don't think. It's only for a light session, isn't it? Go on then, you go see mummy. He needs to go and have a rest. He'll get there, he'll turn around and come back saying he's alright now. There he is, there look. Ah, oh, you've, chopped, you've chopped him. But it'll do, we'll keep it. Yeah. Some half decent cast flight, but. No, no massive flat lug to be honest. You get an odd couple. Let's see, we've got a few in there. Little goes for a small session, I suppose. Right. Well, let's just explain. Right, what we've got here, double header we're calling them. Oh, two, two together. So we're going to dig trench down the side of them both. It's not trench, it's just... Right, it's like a little trench here down the side of them both and we'll see if we can get them both at the same go. If you don't get one out of two, I'll be disappointed. <laughs> And as usual, there's always a big stone stopping you from doing your job. There's one. Oh, oh yeah, there, there's one of them. There's one. One out of two ain't bad. One out of two, that'll do. Yeah. Oh, there you go. 
getting any more or we've got enough there haven't we got enough there Unfortunately, it's been, it's been hit by summit down on Skinning Grove. I think it's a porpoise. Now we're back at the car now, finished product. Nice little handful of worm. Beautiful. Not bad for 20 minutes worth of digging. Nice, right, so what do we say to the people? Say, see, see you next time. See you next time. <laughs>